Quotable quote. Wow. Yes. Based on experience. <laughs> family welcome back to another quarantine date night and today we're going to be answering another set of LDR questions however today we're not going to be virtually online but Arnell and I will be answering this together in person <laughs> look who's home Ta -da! <laughs> me <laughs> guys so now finally i'm here na we are under quarantine now may mga naisipan kami pwedeng gawin because of your tremendous support sa amin opo mag q and a tayo so sasagutin namin ngayon <laughs> yung mga LDR yes. questions <laughs> tapos shout din sa Canada na tayo so dapat why, why na hindi <laughs> na emperador hindi na tando yes. ay why na po tayo? So for those who doesn't know us yet, just a little backstory. We're in a long distance relationship for more than seven years. Just a week ago, dumating dito si Arina sa Canada. So no more LDR. Aww. And grabe po yung support nyo guys. So but first time lang po namin na nakatanggap ng ganun kadaming likes, ganun kadaming shares. And yung pinakalas na video namin na yung pagdating ko yung pag-group namin ni Jen. Yun yung pinakamaraming views namin, guys. Thank you! <laughs> Sobrang dami ng questions ninyo. Hindi namin makakover lahat. Pero itatry namin yung pinaka-general na mga questions mm -hmm. na makaka-relate talaga lahat. <laughs> First question. What was the hardest part in your LDR? And what made you stay other than love? What about the pick? Pick. Isa pa, isa pa. What about pick? Okay, yung pinaka mahirap na part I think sa relationship namin especially sa LDR relationship is yung communication and time kasi meron kayong mga iba't ibang ginagawa habang malayo kayo wait, di ng camera di bibo aray, aray, aray truck kasi guys yung ginagamit kasi guys yung ginagamit namin camera is yung iPhone 12 Pro Max so may tatlong camera so so, kaya, okay, satla. May iba't iba kayong um, ginagawa. Siyempre, meron family, may career ka. Tapos, may personal na mga hobbies ka. Tapos, siyempre, yung relationship ninyo. Kailangan ninyong i-balance out mm -hmm. sa lahat. May feeling minsan na parang walang time. Feeling mm -hmm. minsan na... Uh, asan, parang minsan di ka priority. Uh -oh. Asan ako sa goals mo? <laughs> parang ganun. <laughs> uh, what made me stay other than love is my respect and um, trust sa kay Jen. Kasi syempre siya yung tao talaga na never nag-doubt sa akin and never akong pinafeel na mag-doubt ako sa kanya. Feeling ko hindi ko lang siya wife ngayon, hindi ko lang siya girlfriend dati, kundi partner ko talaga siya into everything. Aww. Ha? Kinikilig! <laughs> <laughs> yung nagpa-stay sa amin other than love is our partnership talaga na sobrang solid. I would say na yung <laughs> Um, hardest part, the same thing. Greatest enemy talaga yung lack of communication and lack of time. Kasi, as, um, as a woman, oh, mas clingy tayo, I think, kesa sa mga guys. I mean, we always want their attention, their time. Pag hindi na nila binigay yun, parang we feel like 
um, hindi na tayo importante, ganon. So, we always need to be reassured. That's why every time na like hindi kami nag-uusap, ganon, kung ano-ano na, nagsastart na tayo mag-overthink. Mm -hmm. So, I think that's one of the biggest talaga for me. And then, when it comes to like other things na made me stay other than love, it's really friendship with Arnel. Kasi he's been my best friend since... I went to Canada. Um, yung parang every time na meron kang constant na companion yung mm -hmm. pwede mong makausap. And then I started telling him my secrets. Mm -hmm. Yeah! So good job! Question. How do you handle LDR relationship? Advice to handle LDR relationship, you should have a lot of patience. Kasi that's gonna be challenged a lot of times. Minsan mahirap mag-handle mag ng relationship na kayong dalawa lang. Kailangan nyo ng support system talaga. Isa sila sa mga tao na makakatulong talaga sa'yo. Mm -hmm. Siyempre, pipiliin mo kasi hindi lahat ng tao naniniwala sa LDR. Mm -hmm. Katulad nating lahat dito na naniniwala tayo sa LDR. Out, out to F God. Oh, sabi niya, minsan daw, kinakain siya ng insecurities. At iniisip niya, paano na lang kung makanap siya ng ibang mas mm -hmm. malapit. Yung mm -hmm. boyfriend niya. <laughs> hindi pala to yeah. question. Statement pala <laughs> Actually, sa mga questions na nakuha namin, more on sa trust issues talaga. Feeling ko sa mga babae, yun yung nafe-feel nila minsan sa ating mga lalaki. Kasi um, hirap tayo minsan na to make them feel secured. That is why nagiging ano sila, tamang hinala sila. Yung mga doubt sila. Kasi mm -hmm. the moment na mararamdaman ng babae na may hindi siya secured, parang hindi siya safe, parang may something mali sa relationship, pigla kang nag-call, doon na magsistart na magiging toxic yung relationship. Either sa babae o sa lalaki. Actually, hindi lang sa babae yun. Mm -hmm. Nagiging toxic yung tao once they feel insecure. Uh, remind them time to time na uh, they're enough, you're appreciated. Any gesture that you can do na ma-remind sila. And sa mga girls naman, um, I've been there yung insecurity and dyan talaga, it's pretty normal. Yung mapapayo ko lang, kasi prone tayo sa overthinking. I wanna emphasize that. Every time na sumagi sa utak nyo na like, baka meron na siyang iba, ganun, napapaisip kayo, um, always go back, like sa promises nyong dalawa. Um, what I would do is, try nyong maging open sa boyfriend nyo. Nagsistart na kayong mag-worry, nagsistart kayong overthink. Open up na kaagad. Like, don't wait for it na mag-gather tapos yung biglang mag burst out na lang kayo sa boyfriend nyo. Kasi doon nagsistart yung away. Based on experience. <laughs> Kailangan ba mag-usap everyday pag LDR? I don't know if yung good morning, good night is a form Consider of na, yeah, ano. na nag-uusap kayo. Pero kailan nyo lang ipa-feel na time to time na nandun kayo. Mag -try, as much as possible, try to greet each other and try to start your day and end your day. And uh, talking to each other. Yeah. You don't have to talk every day, like na tutok talaga, na parang kini. <laughs> <laughs> Naganon talaga, kasi siya uh -oh. eh, kailangan mo din maginteract sa life mo don. Di ka pwedeng maging absent don sa kung saan ka physically. So try to <laughs> connect always. Update nyo lang time to time kung ano nang yare sa inyo. I think that's one of the biggest yeah. advice. Mm -hmm. na mabibigay natin. Mm -hmm. Communication is key talaga, guys. Yeah. Bested and proven. Mm -hmm. So, kung meron man kayong mga um, boyfriend or girlfriend na nag-work as um, marine, mm -hmm. ang tawag? Mar na seaman. O, yung malayo, yung uh -huh. minsan hindi sila makakommunicate sa iyo. Always appreciate. Tolerate. No, appreciate. Okay. Every time and effort na binibigay nila, kahit good morning, good night, mm -hmm. huwag kayong magalit pag uh, natatagalan silang mag-reply. Mm -hmm. Kasi they're just trying their best to, mm -hmm. you know, balance their work and also your relationship. Maganda yung sinabi ni Jen na um, girls or guys try to understand kung mm -hmm. medyo busy. Pero syempre, sa atin din, mga taong busy lagi. Um, try to understand then na yung patience ng tao is may hangganan. Kahit gano'ng kakamahal ng tao, may hangganan yun. Napagod ba kayo sa LDR? May moments ba na you feel like giving up? Ah. Ako, I, I did. Uh -huh. yeah. It's normal. Um, siguro nung time na nasa Malaysia ka, mm -hmm. until nung time na um, nagbarko siya, yun siguro yung pinaka-hardest part na parang I almost felt like I was about to give up. Yung parang sabi ko, Maybe this is a sign na baka mm -hmm. hindi talaga tayo para sa isa't isa mm -hmm. kasi parang sobrang busy yung parang mm -hmm. sabi ko sa kanya na 
Ah, sabi ko pa nga sa'yo na I was um, falling out of love. Mm-hmm. Pero, nung ano naman, nung kinausap na ako ni Arnel, nung nag-usap na kami, para na-realize ko na that's only because mixed emotions na ako noon. Tapos, sobrang overthink na ganun. Yung lack of communication, feeling mo undervalued ka, yung wala na yung reassurance, ganun. So, pag wala na yung mga um, aspects na yon parang biglang... You feel like giving up. Actually, si Jen, um, nung sobrang busy ko, so, binigay niya na ako ng ultimatum na kailangan ko malaman kung asan ako sa plans mo. Yeah. Yung parang ganun. No? I questioned your yeah. priority. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Kung saan talaga, saan talaga yung, mm-hmm. yung destination ko. Kasi um, kailangan mong mag-sacrifice kung ano talaga yung priority mo. Sure. So, gladly napili ko talaga yung tamang priority ko in life. Oh, wow. Yes. <laughs> The grass is greener here. <laughs> I love the Canadian sun. I love the Canadian sun. What? <laughs> yes, it's so golden. <laughs> what are your tips on how to strengthen long distance relationship? To strengthen long distance relationship mm. is Ito yung ginagawa niyo ngayon, yung nagsa-study kayo tungkol sa long distance relationship. Yes. Ano na video, tinatag niyo yung yung partner ninyo mm. sa mga post namin. Uh, sobrang malaking bagay yun kasi na-uplift nyo yung isa't isa. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Sobrang na, um, na-encourage nyo yung isa't isa. You sobrang, stay inspired. Mm, yun. Kailangan yun ng inspiration talaga guys. Mm-hmm. Kasi um, sa sobrang dami ng doubts in this world, sobrang daming negativities, yes, negativities naka-affect ng emotions natin. Mm-hmm. Kailangan natin ng inspiration na nakaka-relate tayo, na sobrang kapareho ng ating situation. And I wanna add, yung pag-build ng trust mm-hmm. towards your partner, it's really a big thing. Kasi, without trust, it's gonna be hard to survive long-distance relationship. Mm-hmm. You can't be uh, yung like, very strict sa partner mo kasi wala kang trust. You need to grow individually. Yes. And in order to do that, you have to build trust. <laughs> can distance ruin a relationship? Distance cannot ruin relationship, but doubts and insecurities will. That's the tweet. That's the tweet. <laughs> we are a proof na distance cannot ruin a relationship. People do. People ruin the relationship. Not distance. So it takes two to tango. And Pag merong mag- isang mag-give up sa inyo, well, that ruins it. Yeah. Hindi yung distance. Never. Kasi yung ibang tao nga na together nag Yes. That's right. It takes diba? two to tango and five to break dance. <laughs> <laughs> Coatable coat! Why does it pay to wait? It pays to wait because so pang rewarding kung makukuha mo yung bagay na inaantay mo for a for long, long time. time. May kita ko siya every day, walang time limit, walang uh, flight na hahabulin kasi nandito na ako sa tabi niya. Mm-hmm. I am home. Yeah. yeah, so sobrang rewarding nung feeling, sobrang sarap ng feeling na finally worth it yung pag-aantay namin. <laughs> it pays to wait kasi nga you're um, building up anticipation, yeah. yung excitement nyo and doon, yung hindi kayo yung parang um, when you're like when you're together, let's just say uh, parang normal na lang, mm. ganun, ordinary. Pero may difference talaga if it's a long distance relationship na meron kang nilolook forward na pag hihintayin ko yung tao na to until whenever. Yes. Pag magiging together na kami, lahat ng mga dreams namin, lahat ng mga prayers and um, yung mga gusto namin gawin, magagawa na namin. Please enjoy the journey, not just the destination. Yes, that's right. Ah, Quotable again. Hi, Team LDR. Hi. 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 Team LDR din for almost 4 years. Iyak ako nang iyak while watching your video. I'm happy for you guys. Thank you me. My My Salazar. Is there cheating that happened during your LDR phase? Yung kagandahan kay Jen is never siya nagdoubt talaga sa akin na Yeah, true. Ay, babae ba diyan? Sino ka usap mo diyan? Sino mo kasama mo diyan? Yun. Wala talaga. Never kami nagkaganong conversation. Never kaming... Yun yung kinaproud ko sa kanya kasi never kami nagkaganong na conversation. Hindi mo ba kilala yung character nung, nung mm. partner mo para mag-doubt ng ganun? So, sobra yun yung kinaproud ko sa kanya kasi never, never siyang nag-doubt. But then you never gave mm. me a reason to doubt. Oh. Siguro. <laughs> See? Proud. 
Pero never dismiss your feelings if may nafe-feel kayong ganun kasi nangyayari talaga 'yun. Hindi fairy tale, hindi fairy tale yung LDR. Um, ano lucky lang talaga kami na ganun yung sa amin. Kilala namin yung isa't isa. Pero don't dismiss your feeling kasi um, sometimes yung pinag-uugutan din naman kayo. Valid yung feelings ninyo. Pero yung kailangan nyo lang i-check is yung character ng partner ninyo. If magagawa niya ba talaga yung ganun. Thank so you. may situation naman siya na hindi daw supportive yung friends and family niya sa relationship nila. Don't uh, listen to your friends and family members na nag-feed sa inyo ng negative thoughts. Kasi, it will always depend on you guys. Mm -hmm. Kayo yung nasa relationship. <laughs> <laughs> Kayo yung nakakakilala sa isa't isa. Kaya, just yeah. don't change your mindset. Yeah. Always stay positive. Yeah. Don't give too much weight sa opinion nila kasi mm -hmm. they don't know your struggle. Kayo yung dalawa yung nakakalam. Yes sa struggle ninyo, kung ano yung goals ninyo, kung anong priorities ninyo. Hindi nila alam yan. Yung alam lang nila yung magkalayo kayo. Wala na yun yeah. magkalayo kayo eh. Mm -hmm. Pero, uh, pero, <laughs> pero, <laughs> kayong dalawa yung nakakaalam. So, support nyo yung isa't isa. Yes. Um, hindi nyo ma-change yung family ninyo. Mahirap i-change yung friends ninyo. Pero, mm -hmm. yung feelings ninyo, yun yung mas permanent. Yeah. Nandito kami to support you guys. So, Aww. don't worry. Tapos na! <laughs> cheers! In the club! <laughs> yes, cheers! Last na lang. Last message. Last message. Last message for everybody. <laughs> Babe! Babe! Okay. So, um, pinaka last message siguro is um, enjoy nyo yung experience you now. Yes. Enjoy nyo yung uh, distance, enjoy nyo yung um, pinagdadaanan ninyo. Kasi hindi lahat ng tao kaya yan. Mm. Sobrang amazing lang na, especially yung nag-post kami, sobrang amazing na sobrang dami pa lang tao yung nakaka-relate sa amin. Na... Sobrang dami nagtatag ng mga friends That means din na maraming gustong mm -hmm. makasurvive talaga yes. sa long distance relationship. Yes. So, if kami na kaya namin, of course, mm -hmm. makakaya namin. Kaya din, din. Yeah. Kasi, hindi, yung LDR, mahirap pero hindi imposible. Tsaka, don't feel very stressed because it's not gonna get you there any faster. Yes. Um, always, sabi ko nga, stay positive. Um, enjoy each other's mm -hmm. company. Enjoy the journey. Yun lang talaga. Mabilis lang. Time flies so fast. Yes. So. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yay! So thank you guys for watching. Um, we're gonna have our next vlog. It's gonna be about a day in our quarantine life. Mm -hmm. We're actually literal po kami nasa quarantine mm -hmm. ngayon. Even though ngayon tapos na yung Q&A namin, pwede pa din kayong mag-send ng mga questions sa amin. Yes. Pwede namin i-answer yan time to time, mm -hmm. personally, kasi nag reach out talaga kami yeah. uh, sa inyo. And uh, sobrang sarap sa feeling na nakaka-receive kami ng ma mga messages. Messages, yes. Because from... nai-inspire din kami sa mm -hmm. mga stories niyo. Yeah, hindi na kami nakakatulog <laughs> <laughs> sa mga messages niyo. Pero sobrang saya, sobrang sarap mm -hmm. sa feeling. So, Keep it coming, guys. So, thank you, guys. We'll see you again soon. Bye. 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 <laughs> Bye. Two, 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 two. Bye. <laughs>